After winning the first three games, uh, you lost in the semifinal. What are your feelings? Well, uh, of course, terrible. Uh, I think we it was a really tight game. Uh, the first period was our was our best. Uh, we should have capitalized the scoring chance what we had. I think the biggest thing about today's game was uh, that uh, the uh, goalie played a good game. Uh, and uh, otherwise, uh, second period wasn't the, wasn't that good from us. But the third was again better hockey. Little small things. What comes to do you win the game or not? And it was you lose. We lost one face off in the third period and. That was pretty much it. They got that one. They got that shot. But the big thing was we should have, when we the first period we should have capitalized and we should have been leading, leading more because at that time of the game we were better. But uh, it doesn't matter. We didn't do the small things that well. We didn't go to the net. We didn't do tips, and that's where we have to get better to to when the season goes on. Why would you think that your team uh, let up after that great first period? You had 22 shots in the first, but you only had about 13 or 14 in the rest of the game. What, what was the reason? Oh, well, of course, uh, Sweden's a good team, like, but uh, uh, they picked up their game, and uh, we started doing a little bit playing a little bit too hard. Uh, or not, not hard, hard is not the right word, but we didn't pass a uh, little should have been passing and playing the same simple game, what we do, and uh, that was a little bit it, but still, I, I think in third, second and third period, we had also good chances where we could have scored, but uh, that was a tough loss, tough, of course, uh, really tough loss, but uh, we have to learn from this, and now we have to go to the bronze game, and we want to win that. Uh, you decided to start uh, Isa Kangas in this game as well, uh, how would you rate his performance? I think he played a good game. Uh, two goals in, and still he had over 27 saves. We didn't lose for the goalie, of course. He had he had lots of good good saves, and uh, I think he played a good game. Uh, it was one tip goal, and uh, and then also actually two t deflection goals what went in for him. Otherwise, he played a good game. Okay, uh, the Finland Sweden rivalry is a very old historic rivalry, and you can see it on the ice. Uh, did you have to tell the players to keep their emotions down a bit? Yeah, well, of course, it's uh, always these games are really, really tough, uh, are really great to play, but it also that you have to. But I guess we have uh, good captains and good team. Like we had to keep it down. Then we had some little bit some injuries during the game, but that's normal and. Uh, and but then I th think sometimes like third period we we were we did our thing but uh, we just couldn't capitalize our chances. Okay, and one more question: uh, After winning three games, your team was poised to get a very good result here, um, but after that disappointing loss, how hard is it to find the motivation for the third place game? Ah uh, well, of course now it feels like it, but I think tomorrow and the big big thing is that. When tomorrow comes, and uh, we're still playing from the bronze medal, and we want want that, and we want to keep keep going, involving as a team, like getting better as a team. And, and there's still seven months. The World Championships was the main goal. This is just uh, this is a practice tournament, and we have to learn what learn about these situations.